Remco, what was your message when you crossed the line and why have you gone so low from so far out? Uh, the message was uh, the O from uh, Umi, it's from my wife. So uh, she said if I would take my third victory, I had to dedicate it to her. So uh, that's the answer. And why did you go from so far out? Uh, I felt I, uh, that I was the strongest of the group and that I, I didn't have to waste any time and I just had to go for it. So uh, yeah, I felt that the legs were super good today. I had a bit of day like I had in uh, uh, in stage uh, 14, so uh, it's an amazing stage to win again. I think it was a, a super good opportunity to take the points for my jersey. I, I took all the points and uh, my third stage win, it's uh, it's amazing to end the Vuelta with. Before La Vuelta, you said that many things can happen in a Grand Tour, but if you end up with three or four stage win and 12 overall, it's still a very good Vuelta. Do you confirm this? Yeah, exactly. I think uh, after my uh, off day in uh, in Formigal and Tourmalet, I think I just had to turn the page and go for the stages. And I think uh, I won three of the most beautiful stages from this Vuelta. So, uh, and I take the mountain jersey. So I think it's uh, yeah, it has been an amazing Vuelta. Even though um, the GC plan didn't work out, but I think we can be very proud. And uh, yeah, it's amazing to finish. It to finish the stage with such a good feeling and uh, to have such a good legs in the end of the world, that means that I'm uh, that I keep improving and I just had a bit of a bad week in the second week. So uh, yeah, I think uh, we should just be happy and proud.